we, we've just completed a staff meeting with our team here at the National Insurance and Social Security Service. Um, our first staff meeting, team meeting as the new entity. We spoke to a very satisfied team of employees who have committed themselves to going forward with the organization, going forward with a focus on service, improving service to the public. We have committed as a government and as the executive management of the organization to ensuring that our promise that the workers of the National Insurance and Social Security Service will move forward in the organization at no less, with no benefits reduced. As a matter of fact, our commitment to them is that we will continue to do all that we can to make sure that their positions are improved. I have asked them as we move forward in improving the service and the performance of the organization, that they be uh, an important part of that work by giving us their suggestions. Their suggestions, as we've done in the past, we will continue to use those suggestions to deconstruct and reconstruct to make sure that the public, the Barbadian public and all those who contribute and who may have reason to make claims on the various funds of the National Insurance and Social Security Service, we need to make sure that those beneficiaries, those claimants, those workers in Barbados are served well. We know that the issue is not just the performance of individuals, it also involves the processes that we use. And sometimes the public is at the receiving end, not of a person who is not able to respond or, or who is not sensitive to their plight, but because there may, there may be systems in place that do not allow them to do what the claimant, the worker, may consider to be in their best interest. We are in the process of doing that deconstruction and reconstruction, and we have engaged with our workers, our team, so that they can be fully a part of that process. Those with whom we have interacted have expressed a lot of happiness at being a part of the new organization. As we, I, I said before, nearly two and a half percent of those persons who were allocated to NIS by the Ministry of the Public Service and who were working here, 92.5% of those persons have transitioned and have gone on. We, the National Insurance and Social Security Service deals with people and people who are sometimes in vulnerable positions. And so we've always shared with our team members that we understood that there would be some, in, in the minds of some people, you know, some kind of fear, some kinds of trepidation as we move forward. They are happy and we are happy. But I thought that even though the transition is now passed by both houses of parliament and has been assented to by our president, even though those legal and procedural hurdles have been, are now passed, it was still incumbent on us to say to our team that this is still a work in progress. We are working with them to make sure that we're not staying where we are now.